Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Hey everyone, it's Ian K back again with another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews. Finishing out on what's been a pretty wild Wendy's weekend of new releases, guys. The pretzel goodness is back on the menu over here and I've had a lot of fun checking these out up till now. So let's see if I've saved the best for last with their all new pretzel bacon puff chicken sandwich. And I gotta say already that pretzel bun is looking pretty amazing. X marks the spot. Let's take a look underneath it. Looks like we've got a combination of that smoky honey mustard sauce and those crunchy pickles, lots of goodness there. And underneath that is the rest of the goodies and they are plentiful. As you can see, we've got plenty of beer cheese, we've got Munster cheese, Applewood smoked bacon, crispy onions. It is really, really a lot of toppings and that's all on top of a homestyle chicken filet, 100% white meat and I gotta say it's looking nice and crispy. Nothing on the very bottom of this one, I don't think you really need anything else. But as you can see, a lot going on and a very delicious situation with that pretzel bun on top of it. Let's see if this one's gonna deliver flavor wise. It's the Pretzel Bacon Pub Chicken Sandwich here at Wendy's. Let's peep out this flavor. Yeah, I'm not even gonna front. Believe it or not, this chicken sandwich is not gonna let me, guys. The cheese game is strong on this here. No matter how you look at this here, there is a lot of goodness, as you can see. A lovely situation. Plenty of Applewood smoked bacon just sticking out for you right there. But that pretzel bun is really setting this one off. X marks the spot, and I gotta say, very, very excited to get into this right now. But before I do, and like always, if you guys are fans of high-quality, delicious-looking food reviews, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to tap that bell icon so you can be notified as soon as brand new content drops every week. Guys, let's do it. The Pretzel Bacon Pub Chicken Sandwich, brand new here at Wendy's. This is looking awesome. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> no. That smoky honey mustard along with the beer cheese and that Munster cheese and the outer coating of the chicken, instantly right away. A little bit of the saltiness, a little bit of the flavorfulness coming through, but wow, it's such a pasty, cheesy feeling that I'm getting. And of course, it's set off with the textural deliciousness of that pretzel bun itself, but guys, juicy chicken on this one. I think I may have saved the best for last, guys. Nothing against the burger. I had a blast checking that out. Take a look at that review popping up on your display right now if you haven't seen that one. This is really, really good. And like I said earlier, the chicken game is pretty awesome over here at Wendy's. I think we can all agree on that. This is pretty banging so far. Let's keep going. Mm. Mm. Yeah, definitely no joke with that Munster cheese along with that beer cheese combination. That is a beautiful situation. And when you add in the nice acidity snap and crunch of those pickles to go with it, Another lovely situation, and of course the smokiness of that honey mustard, as well as the smokiness from the Applewood smoked bacon. I think Wendy's knows what's up with this. And as you can see, thick, juicy white meat on that chicken filet on the bottom, guys. A beautiful situation. Just beautiful. Man, I just knew this was going to be delicious, and I have a feeling a lot of you guys did as well. I mean, how can you go wrong with all the ingredients that this one has? Simply swapping out the protein for chicken, and you're really getting pretty much the same experience, but with a juicier type of meat, believe it or not. This chicken is actually pretty much up there with the fresh, never frozen beef that I had a few days ago. This is actually really, really good. Let's keep going in. Mm. That's really good. Yeah, this is the quality chicken filet that completely upholds the reputation of the chicken game over here at Wendy's. And I gotta say guys, very, very solid. And as you can see again, just no shortage of goodness with this one here. Every bite is flavorful. You're gonna get a little bit of everything in just about every bite here. And there's just so much of it. Aside from the crispy onions, believe it or not, which are adding just a little bit extra on the back end, mixed in with everything else, just a beautiful situation. But guys, again, just a lovely sandwich. I'm glad the pretzel buns are back. These need to stay on the menu a lot longer. Six years is a long time to keep these pretzel buns off the menu, Wendy's, just so you know. You really gotta keep these around a little bit longer. Considering I did a version of this about six years ago, this actually is a much better version of that, naturally because there's so much more on it, and with everything that it's got, with the juiciness of that white meat on top of it, the homestyle breading, just everything about it really, really sings. So one more bite, we'll finish this one up after the rating, but guys, I think you already know what the rating is gonna be on this one, and it is completely worth it, and I think you're gonna agree with me. Seriously, one more bite, and we'll finish it out. Well, the pretzel buns are back over here at Wendy's and they are definitely fantastic. Let's do a little 360 action just to round this one out. And as you can see again, lots of goodness here, guys. There is no shortage of toppings and overall that beer cheese, the Munster cheese combination, along with that smoky honey mustard, that combination is amazing. Add in those pickles, the crispy onions, the apple with smoked bacon. It's just insane. As you can see, swap out the protein for whatever you'd like here, a burger or chicken. You're gonna be satisfied either way. It is very well done. So let's get right to it. The Pretzel Bacon Pub Chicken Sandwich here at Wendy's is gonna get a rock solid 10 out of 10. There is really nothing wrong with any variation of the pretzel sandwiches over here at Wendy's. Depending upon your preference for beef or chicken, you have a lot to look forward to because it's a major showcase of not just the quality of the beef and the quality of the chicken over here at Wendy's, but those toppings that are all premium. And there's so many of them, guys. As you can see in that laundry list in the beginning and all throughout, there's a lot to enjoy. And like I said, it's really set off on top of that 
with the textural nice doughiness, if I can call it that, of the pretzel bun because it's got a little bit of doughiness, it's got a little bit of firmness. It makes it very, very unique and the flavor is just, it just delivers guys, it just delivers. All right, so now the all important question after this trifecta of Wendy's reviews, which is gonna be your personal favorite? Which one do you think you're gonna be looking forward to try the most there? Is it gonna be the burger variation? Is it gonna be the chicken variation? Is it gonna be just the fries? Drop some comments down below and let me know your thoughts on any or all of these entries because they are really, really solid for Wendy's over here right now. And with that, this is ENK closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey Wendy's, quick question for you. Do you think it would be too much to maybe try, say, a fish sandwich with these pretzel buns? Hmm. All right guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.